The storms are coming. Are you ready? Hello, my Flat Earth family. I know this is a little bit unconventional. Um, we just had some awesome storms roll through. I don't know if I changed the angle here, if you can see behind me. There we go. Really fantastic storms. It's still rumbling in the distance, some thunder. And I just had a lightning bolt right behind me in the clouds. It was fantastic. We'll see. I don't know if I'll be able to get it if it happens again because it's so bright in the background. Standing in front of a soybean field behind my house. And there's a couple things I wanted to um, address this evening. First thing, um, good news. Uh, if you ha guys have been following Mad Mike Hughes, who is the um, homegrown rocket scientist who has um, joined forces with the Flat Earth community. He is building a steam-powered rocket at this moment while you're listening to this video log. Um, and he's going to be taking that rocket on a trip to um, break a record and I think he's going to try to take that rocket one mile and it's going to be manned and he's actually going to be in that rocket. Um, we've been, as a community, raising money to get the words research flat earth on the side of that rocket. And I am proud to say and excited to say that we did succeed. And I will put a picture up here in the corner um, of the said rocket, it is bright red and it says in big, bold, beautiful letters, research flat earth. Very exciting. We're also getting um, decals on the side of the rocket launcher as well. So that is some fantastic news, but we are still supporting Mad Mike Hughes. Um, there's still a GoFundMe account set up to uh, raise money to help support him get this uh, rocket launch underway and so that he can um, break this world record. Uh, because it's going to be really amazing exposure for us flat earthers. He is a flat earther. And after he breaks this record, this rocket is going to be placed in museums. And he's going to have media coverage. And he's going to be doing interviews. And it's just going to be incredible exposure and, and um, opportunity to plant seeds and talk to others about flat earth. So I'm very, very excited about this. The second thing I wanted to mention this evening was um, something a little bit more unnerving. Uh, I wanted to share with you something that happened to a very good friend of mine. Uh, he goes by DITRH on YouTube. Um, that stands for Deep Inside the Rabbit Hole. He has had his content channel removed because of copyright strikes, bogus copyright strikes to be exact. And I wanted to just put it out there and let the community know if they're looking for his um, YouTube channel that it has been removed, unfortunately. But he has bounced back immediately. He has created another channel already and has uploaded a lot, a ton of videos that he had before. So I will be sharing that new link as well in this description because I support his work. Um, he is an excellent truth seeker. He's excellent at spreading the truth. He has been pivotal in my journey as far as learning about the flat earth. And I, I know for a fact that if you check into his YouTube channel that you will be um, just, it will be so worth it. You will be very, very uh, impressed with the work that he has done. Um, the interviews he has done, the content, the um, experiments, the observations. So just this is, a, is an endorsement for DITRH. Um, and like I said, I'll put the link in the description box of this video. Because I definitely want him to try to get his subscriber list back. Because he was doing such an excellent job at um, getting to the masses and sharing the Flat Earth Truth with so many people. The last thing I wanted to cover... Um, 
I started this video by saying that the storms are coming and are you prepared? Are you ready? There's going to be all kinds of storms that happen to us, whether it be private, whether it be consequences, whether it be, sorry for the interruption, we just had some lightning, that was fantastic, whether it be real storms, um, and whether it be accidents, whether it be something where we are being attacked, and I just wanted to um, talk about that a little bit this evening. I hope y'all can hear that thunder, it's fantastic so much energy in the air right now. Um, there have been people s similar to DITRH that have been attacked recently. Um, YouTube channels attacked, Facebook uh, profiles, Skype, and I myself had an issue a couple months ago as well. Um, I'm not going to lie that things aren't going to get easier. Things might get tougher, especially when you're out there putting your voice out there and trying to expose the lies and trying to bring truth to humanity. That being said, some of the storms that we're going to go through are going to be um, physical and they're going to be accidents and we're not going to be able to guess that's going to happen. But one thing for sure, we're going to need to support each other and we're going to need to band together and help each other when these things happen. Watch out for each other. You know, look out for each other. Stand up for each other. I wanted to bring your attention to some very good Flat Earth, fellow Flat Earthers and Flat Earth friends that were in a very horrific car accident just recently. I wanted to bring this to everyone's attention because I see that they are going to need our help. Uh, their names are Marissa Keeland and Chad Norman. They were in a very, very bad car accident a few days ago. Um, Marissa is going to probably be in the trauma unit for at least 30 days. And Chad is cognizant and able to answer, but he has surgeries in the future and he is very much in a bad way and has a long road to recovery. They both do. Um, in case you aren't familiar with Marissa, and Chad, Marissa, at least her name is associated with this. Um, she has started the Flat Earth group called Flat Earth Club, and that's all in capital letters. And she is responsible for organizing and funding one of our Flat Earth billboards. That's the one that went up in Tulsa, Oklahoma. So, you know, we can all band together and we can all support each other when it comes to raising money for these billboards. But when something like this happens and people are, you know, our fellow humans, our fellow flat earthers are extremely hurt. We really need to band together and help them. They're going to need our prayers. If you are the kind of person that prays, they're going to need our thoughts, our positive energy. They're going to need our support. Um, I have already volunteered to help in their group, help admin, along with a couple other people as well, because uh, they're having issues with trolls in their group, and we're going to go in there and try to kind of clean it up just a little bit and um, make sure that the group keeps its same dynamic and the same goals that Marissa really wanted the group to have, and so she doesn't have to worry about that while she's hospitalized. Um, and I just really... Uh, want us to as a flat earth group band together and support these two because they really banded together and supported us when they put out this new uh, flat earth billboard and it is still going it was one that was going to run for four weeks so I'm going to put in this description box a link to the their flat earth group on Facebook I'm also going to put a link to a GoFundMe account that's been put up for them specifically for them um, I do encourage you to help and support if you can. Uh, we really want them to get better as quickly as possible. Their injuries are horrific. If you look at the GoFundMe account, you will see what's going on, especially with Marissa. My prayers and thoughts go out to both of them. So anyway, that's probably all I have to say this evening. It's just a short little video log. I wanted to kind of put those thoughts out there, and I'll put all those links in the description box. Um, so that you guys can easily go to these the GoFundMe account and um, just find the places that you need to go to as far as finding information about what's going on with Marissa and Chad and their group and supporting them 
and also supporting DITRH in his new YouTube channel and also Mad Mike Hughes. Thank you guys for listening. I'm glad we heard a little bit of thunder and saw a little bit of lightning. And this is Agent Sunshine out.